A number of Rhode Island schools have gone back to distance learning to finish out 2020, and because of that, enrollment at some learning centers has increased, serving as a classroom for young students whose parents can't stay home to help with schoolwork. 12 News reporter Rob Nesbitt spoke to the owner of Little Learners and joins us now from their Cranston location. Little Learners here in Cranston was closed Thursday because of the storm. They were still able to provide help to students virtually, one of the many ways learning has changed this year. Little Learners has been focused on early childhood development for 28 years, first at their Johnston location, then Cranston, and most recently this fall in Warwick, each one finding a way to help students who have been learning virtually. Every child does receive or bring in their own Chromebook or piece of technology, and they have learning stations. Owner Charlene Barberry says that her learning centers are set up with certified teachers for students in kindergarten through fifth grade. Since they were allowed to reopen in June, she says they have had one positive coronavirus case that was discovered two weeks ago. We closed down that classroom immediately, worked with the Department of Health and our families to make sure we had a good grasp on controlling the situation. Barberry is also an administrator for Cranston Public Schools at their early childhood center. She believes that schools did everything they could to stay open for in person learning. But she also sympathizes with parents who can't work from home and who are overwhelmed with the financials of child care. We really try to be flexible with our families and always try to meet them in the middle. She says that her learning centers have seen a 25% increase in enrollment since schools started making the switch to distance learning. When it comes to change, she tries to embrace it, knowing that perceptive little ones are watching how the adults around them react. I think if we look at this situation that we're all going through and we try to find the positives in what is happening, it's going to benefit everyone all around. Even with increased enrollment at Little Learners this month, Barberry says that there's still room for more students at their Warwick Learning Center. Reporting in Cranston, I'm Rob Nesbitt, 12 News.